Preparing your blood tubing and some little tidbits you should never forget. This is called Y-tubing. It's got two spikes that essentially join into one, one for the blood and one for a normal saline bag. Make sure to completely clamp the tubing at all parts it can be clamped. We're going to take one side and spike our normal saline bag. Remember, blood can only be hung with normal saline, nothing else. Once spiked, go ahead and prime the line. You'll notice the chamber has a filter in this tubing. Squeeze the chamber so the saline fills past the filter. Once primed, remember to clamp your tubing again. Always super, super important to remember your clamps or else you're going to end up with a mess. Next, we spike the blood. Oop, look at me making sure that my clamps were good. Okay, we're going to now unclamp our blood side and prime the line with our blood. Let the blood run through the tubing and what we're looking for is the end of the line to be pink in color. Prime it slowly. Take your time, we're not wasting any blood here. And remember, we're doing all of our verifications with another RN, scanning all of our barcodes into the MAR and monitoring the patient for the first 15 minutes for reaction.